Hi everyone, it's Raquel from Cali Scrap and Creations. I did just want to share with you another custom order that was just completed. Um, just finished it as of today, so I'll be shipping it out today. Um, the paper line that I used for this paper stack was the, just give me a second. I cannot think of the name of it. Oh, got it. Sorry. It was this one. The Romantique um, Prima line. So I used this one, the 8x8 stack. Um, so in the front, you'll see all the Wild Orchid Craft flowers in the front and sign at, at the side. Um, up here at the top as well. I'm a huge fan of Wild Orchid Crafts. Um, again, my Cali scrapping binding along the side, some flat back pearls and some trim. And this is the back. So I adhered some vintage buttons right here along the side. And in the background, you just hear my Christmas music that I have going on. I'm in the Christmas spirit. So I'll just turn it down. And then I just um, untie it on the side. And this one is for a girl. So, um, I used yellow. Um, I was debating on using the yellow because I never used yellow before, but after looking at how vintage it came out, I just love it. It's like vintage Victorian style. So, here are the tags. And um, like the other previous books, a lot of the custom orders that I get, they want size 4x6 photo, photo mats. So, I did these 4x6. Um, <laughs> <clears throat> and there is the back. Um, I adhered it with some sheer ribbon and a little vintage pearlesque button there. Oh, there was four tags in there. In there. And those just tuck in. And then here's some gorgeous trim that I purchased off from my ladies from Etsy. Some more Wild Orchid Craft flowers. And on this side is the tag holder that I, I just love making because you can just put so many pictures right up underneath here. Um, some bling, some more wild orchid crafts, some vintage um, buttons and trim. And then here are four tags with the same um, sheer ribbon. And that's the back. That was just tuck in so cute. And then on this page, um, I used some lace ribbon shimmy stuff that I have in my stash. Um, this was a flower that I had got at the scrapbooking show and I didn't have any use for it but when I made this book I had some use for it. Um, this is from K and Company. It's a little small baby tag and then these tags just come out there and there are four of them and then that's the back. So for this album, um, she can put gobs and gobs and gobs of girly photos in this book. And then here I adhere like this cute little um, Tattered Angels mirror. So I distressed the inside so she can do some little journaling there. Here's a fabric flower and then um, some flat back pearls. And then this just slides from underneath there. So for more pictures. and picture picture and then on this side just some wild orchid craft flowers and let me undo this and then I just said here the little journaling spot that came with the paper line because I thought that was super cute and then it just opens like this so that she can put more pictures so a picture can actually go right there as you can see and then two pictures there then I'm actually going to take the time to tie this back because next thing you know I'll be done shipped it and it won't be tied. <gasps> um, and then on this is just some more little fringy lace trim. Um, this is like a crocheted flower. Don't get me to lying about where I got it from. I don't even remember. Um, I just have so much stuff sometimes that you know I'll be looking for a certain thing and being that I did use yellow it kind of went so good with it. And then that portion just opens up like that. So you can put a picture here because it's not stuck down. It's a little bit of room so she can put a photo right here. 
and then the photos in the inside and then here it just it here just a pocket right here and then I hear the K and company little baby tag there and then here's some more tags and this this tag I don't know if you guys can see it but it, it's felt right there it's so cute so it feels like velvet or um, suede it feels like suede I guess you could say it feels like suede and then that's the back and then all adhered with some little vintage buttons there in the shimmery ribbon lace then on this side um, just a diagonal pocket um, more tags in the inside for photos And then here are some wild orchid craft flowers here. And then on this page, I use some wild orchid craft flowers here. And then with those cute butterflies with the little bling and all that, I just love those. Um, the picture can actually slide up underneath here, along there. Then there's some little trim at the top. And then this is the last page. Um, like I said, it's like a tag holder. I'm so loving how I make these now. It just makes it so much easier for people to put pictures in because um, they hold the tags and it's just so convenient. So then those are the last tags that are in this back pocket. As you can see, it's blinged out with some bling and wild orchid crab flowers and that cute little butterfly. And then that is the back. And then I just adhered some more um, yellow ribbon along the edge right here just to give it a little yellow to tie this in and that is my book so I hope you all like it um haven't thought of a title for this book yet but um I'm pretty sure to come to me by the time I get it on YouTube so you guys have a wonderful day and happy holidays bye